utilization of contrast as main substance in paper wrap making. Hi, my name is Muhammad Hazim bin Zani Lukman. My name is Arash Putra Mukris bin Zamari. And my name is Arash Bin Zamari Ahmad Nizam. And together, we managed to done our research with the help of our EC advisor, Ms. Shahira Ms. Azmi. Objective of this research is to investigate appropriate substance that can be used in paper making. Second, to produce an eco-friendly paper bag that benefits the environment. The problem statement, paper product forms a major part of the waste stream, ending up in drains and waterways, causing problems such as flash floods and stagnant pools where mosquitoes breed. This then leads to other problems like diseases, landslides, and traffic congestion. Paper recycling can significantly reduce the quantity of materials being thrown into landfills every day. It also saves the local council a huge amount of money as they spend between 40 to 70% of their annual allocation on waste collection and disposal. The procedures prepare a bunch of corn, old newspaper, square basin, and water. Prepare a blender, pour clothes, paper mold, frame, pot, and sponge. Peel a seed's corn husk and cut it to small pieces. Pour one liter of water into a pot with the corn husk and heat up until boiled. Remove excess water and put aside. Tear the old newspaper into small pieces and put it in the blender. Next, blend it with water until it forms pulp. After that, Put the boiled corn husk into the blender and blend it with the pepper pulp. Pour the mixture into the square basin and add some water. Use the pepper mold frame to get the pepper size that is wanted. Place the mold containing the mixture on a cloth. Press sponge on the mold to absorb the excess water. Allow it to dry on the sun for 2 to 3 days until all water has evaporated. Finally, the conclusion. First, consumers could switch to a recyclable and biodegradable product so as for integrating sustainable lifestyle. Second, it helps in saving huge amounts of energy because it is made from locally available materials. Third, we should discover more new alternatives that are sustainable in order to protect the mother nature. That's all from us. Muhammad Hazim Arash Putra Mukis and Wan Nashmudin. Thanks for watching!